I'm Annie Bourdonnais. I'm an assistant professor here at the University of South Carolina. Uh, I got my PhD at the University of Victoria, uh, British Columbia in Canada uh, in marine science. I'm mostly interested in uh, looking at nitrogen, cycling, marine and uh, aquatic terrestrial environment. Uh, I'm using a uh, stable isotope, which is an awesome tool to trace the different processes, but also the source and the fate of nitrogen in different systems. And why it's in my research is important is because nitrogen is an essential micronutrient for all living organisms. Uh, what makes my research amazing is that we get to travel all around the globe. We uh, do research in the Arctic, in the tropical area. We also look at really, uh, we also look at really important societal problems, for instance, harmful um, algal blooms that really impact, uh, really have an um, uh, impact on the societies. So my lab has been extremely open to uh, hiring undergrad. Uh, a year ago, we had literally an army of undergrad. Uh, I think I had nine undergrad working uh, in my lab at that time. So we've been incredibly open in training uh, new people using relatively complex in instrumentation. Right now, I have two, uh, two grad students with a new one coming uh, in the fall. So uh, in always, I always have at least two or three undergrad working in the lab. So I'm teaching three classes since I'm here at the University of South Carolina. I have been teaching uh, a large undergrad class, which is called Ocean and Society. Um, this is for non-major students that want to learn about um, basic concept about the ocean. I've also been teaching a major cl class for the marine science program, which is called Chemistry of the Sea, Marine Science 313. And this is really to introduce, uh, it takes the, all the chemistry concept that the student learn in their um, earlier chemistry class and apply this, these concepts to the ocean. Uh, and I've been teaching a grad class, uh, isotope geochemistry. And now, of course, teaching is it's always uh, interesting to, to, uh, to get to know the student, really uh, know their needs, also what they understand versus, you know, it's, it's kind of, this is where I recruit some of my students. It's always rewarding to, to be able to, uh, to teach and transmit your knowledge and bring your student in your lab and show them all the, the instrumentation works and give them like some, some uh, opportunity to work with it. So I don't know any other school that where the faculty is so dedicated to their student. We're really there to help and we're really dedicated to their success and uh, we go to the field, we're in the lab with them. Like I, I don't know many uh, program which offer such a, lots of opportunity for hands on uh, experience either in the lab or the field. So we, we have amazing opportunity, we do interesting research and we uh, involve undergrad early on in our research. Yeah, so we have lots of uh, amazing instrumentation here. So we have a mass spectrometer, we have a nutrient analyzer, we, we have lots of field work opportunities, so please come join us. <laughs>